I am on the ferry. My friend Peggy is right there. And we are rocking. And oh my God, what's going on with my hair? Humid. This is cool. I've never done this before. Hey everybody, this is where I woke up today. I'm at a casino parking lot. This is the Golden Nugget. That's my friend Peggy right there. And we're on our way to Lafayette, Louisiana. Our first stop was called Vermilionville, which is a historic village in Lafayette, which has all of these beautifully restored Acadian and Creole structures from the 17th and 1800s. We got to stay overnight in their parking lot through Harvest House for free. And then we paid our $10 to go in and check out the exhibits. Now I love history, so I would have been happy just to walk around and see everything and look at the gardens, but score, turns out that we were there on the day of a celebration. After the party, we set off to see the really amazing reconstructions of these grounds and houses and interiors. It really gave us a feeling of how life was in Lafayette in the early 19th century. And again, just made me pinch myself, realizing how lucky I am that because I live in an RV, I can hit the road and see places like this anytime I want. And I talked to this guy for a while too. He was awesome. And I have to tell you, the schoolhouse was my favorite building and exhibit because for 50 years, it was actually illegal here for students to speak French in class. Who knew? Gotta love history. Then I met this character, literally, standing on a porch. Do we remind you of anyone? We're walking around one of these restored houses and it's very cool, but everyone in here looks like they're gonna jump right out of these photos and like slash your throat. All the kids, all the adults and all the photos. It's kind of creepy in this one. Hey buddy, just chilling, huh? Got some friends? You're very pretty. Every bathroom that we saw had a sign saying that the toilets were non-functional, which tells you they probably had a problem at some point. Look at these chairs, short people lived here. Look, we can take the little ferry across, but we have to pull it ourselves. Let's do it. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'll help. I think we win. And then we just had lunch at the Cajun Buffet and chilled before heading back out to our rigs for the night, thanks to Harvest House. My friend and I have had a great time passing through Lafayette, Louisiana, using Harvest House. If you guys are not familiar with Harvest House, I've said it a million times, I think it's the most screaming deal in RV life. I think it's 99 bucks now, but I have a 15% off coupon that I'll link down below, either in the description or at the top of comments. That's for a year. And then you get this giant map of a ton of different harvest hosts that you can use all over the place. In fact, you know, the friend that I'm traveling with never got harvest hosts until a couple of weeks ago because she thought that it was just breweries or wineries and she doesn't drink. That is not the case. Swamp tours, museums, laser tag, restaurants, alpaca farms, organic farms. There's a ton of stuff. In fact, there's more harvest hosts than there are KOAs. When you see the list, you'll be amazed. So if you don't have this in your arsenal of, of camping go-tos, I recommend it. 
and uh, this is not the end for us. So until then, I hope you're all doing well out there. Have happy travels and be free.